Hey y'all, coming to you from the headquarters of Scotty DTV. But I was at the uh, Grand National Roadster Show in Pomona, California, and uh, I ran into a 70 C10 I think y'all are gonna like. Let me get the camera turned around, we'll take a quick look at it. What about that? Right on. Man, I love these trucks. And this one is, man, there is so much that I like about this truck. First, obviously, the color. Don't paint one blue. Well, that one's blue. I love it, man. That works. Stance. Nailed. And, you know, I mean, it's that generation C10, right? So that's all you really have to do is get the stance nailed. And then after that, it doesn't matter. Patina, it doesn't, you can't really screw one up if you've got a good stance on it. Now, this one, they've got it perfect. And then red line tires. Oh, my goodness. I love the red lines, the blue lines, the gold lines. I love them. I love them, them colored line tires. I just think those are cool. I'm a, from the Hot Wheels generation, right? And then up underneath, it's just uh, very clean. Again, set up to drive. It looks like it might have ride tech there. Coilovers, those look familiar. Shaved, but yet left the door handles. And I, I custom door handles, I guess. And uh, I dig them. I like them. They're big. They're, they're, you know, they're meaty truck door handles, right? Now, this one here, yeah, this one's making me smile for sure. I, I mean, I just absolutely, there's nothing I'd change except for the name on the title. And what they did on the bed, they brought that, they used the satin finish instead of the gloss. Some, you know, nice bead rolling done. The fit and finish is right on. Oh, man. I like this truck. Very cool. And I like the shade of wood that they did because it pops like the rest of the truck does. Took the bumper off, got a nice roll pan there. The wheel choice, awesome. And the interior, you know, it's custom, but yet it still has that, what, like Cheyenne, right? C5, I don't know what I'm thinking of, a Cheyenne package or something to it. Still matches the truck, still fits it very well. Wood steering wheel. You can tell. I really, really like this truck. I like, I just love the color of it. I love everything about it. And here we go. I don't think it's an LS. I think it's a small block, like a 327 or a 350. And it may be a throttle body. Of course, it could be carbureted too. Either way, it's very nice. And again, what I, I love what they did under here. You know, they brought that satin finish in here. They did some really nice bead rolling just to kind of give it an aesthetic look, but not over the top. And all that sits there is the motor, like a ring in the box, just like they're supposed to be. Very, very cool. And, you know, for all you Trailer Queen screamers, there you go. This one's not going to be a Trailer Queen. You can tell this one's set up to drive. It's got all the good stuff, ride tech and such, but... It's, you can tell, it's, it's going to be driven. It'll be clean on top, but at bottom, it's going to see some road rash. Look at that engraving in that door panel. How cool is that? And then they use the satin on the dash. Just awesome, man. Just absolutely awesome. I love this truck. Of course, all these C10s, you yeah, know, they are so cool. I like what they did there. It looks like wood, right? Could be. But I don't know. I do know it's cool. And I even like the carpet choice, which normally I'd say, yeah, you should have done Daytona Weave on that. But it just fits the truck because I think they left enough truck in this truck. Does that make any sense? That's that, you know, you can tell that, yeah, I'd drive this one for 100 years and never change it. So there you go. One very cool 1970 C10 pickup truck slammed to the ground awesome awesome i love it from the grand national roadster show 2018 hope you all have enjoyed it see ya hey y'all make sure you subscribe to this channel and visit scottydtv.com for an easy way to search the hundreds of videos i have posted either click the link in the description or the one at the end of this video